cliffs along the standing stone. Ooh, destroy the stone. How are we gonna get up there? Well, I guess we have flying things. All right, let's try and make something flying. Can we translate? Can we rotate? Set you on ground. Destroy machine. Destroy. Actually, no, I'm, I'm gonna save it first. Save machine as, um... The high reach grabber. There we go. It's, that's what it is. Alright, now we'll destroy the machine. Okay, so let's create something new. Destroy the standing stone. How are we going to get to that? <coughs> oh man, sorry. Right. So let's have a look at the flying things. Actually, let's just put some blocks here. So we've got a structure to work with. So what are the flying things? Flight. A flying block. Oh, it's a screw. Nice. Alright, so what if we put one there? And one there. We have a small aerodynamic propeller. Ah, okay, I think I get the feeling that we need like a moat steering so can, where's the spinning block? Here we go. Does it spin? It does. So I assume that we put a propeller on that. Oh my god. <laughs> this is such a weird thing. Alright, um Let's... I... I don't know. Let's put, um... A balloon in the middle, because why not? And... Balloon... Press O to fly. And what does the spinning block do? Does it actually have a key, or does it just... It just spins. Alright, let's... Oh, the... Uh oh. Okay, I think we need another one going in the other direction. How did it get set on fire? Alright. <laughs> okay, that was interesting. Okay, so we need to have some counter talk. So I think I'm going to put a spinning block in the other direction. And let's just go two blades, actually, just because that might make life a little easier. And we'll have our spinny things. And let's press play. And hey! Oh! We have flight! Kind of. This is madness. Oh dear. I'm sorry, sheep. Oh my goodness, he got eliminated. Okay, and then we're on fire. Alright, let's, um... <laughs> Interesting. Uh... Are these trying to go in opposite directions? I bet they are. Small propeller. Can't change that. Can I change this? Rotation speed. Times two. Times zero. Uh, it looks like I can't change the direction. Now, there was an option, though. There was an option to change this. How do I change the direction? F to invert. Lift direction when hovering over it. Let's just get rid of that. Oops, I'm still under. Uh, let's just make sure we got that selected. Ah! That way. So what if we do now? Nope, now they just spin in the same direction. Okay. That wasn't what I wanted. <laughs> um. Spins that way. Also spins that way. How do I make it go in the other direction? Hmm. So at the moment, that's spinning that way. And that's spinning that way. What if we just not have the propellers? What if we just have, like, a block? Will it just not have the lift? Okay, let's try now. Nope, that didn't work very well at all. Okay, so talk is very interesting in this game. <clears throat> I'm not sure I understand how to do this. Right, let's try... Hmm. See, the lift direction, it just changes the spinny bit. Hmm. Can I rotate this? No? 
I don't think I can. Okay, well this is interesting. Let's try... Let's try, instead of using spinning blocks, let's just try using more of these wing things. Actually, let's just try two balloons. Let's try a balloon here, and a balloon here, and then we'll have a, not a wing panel, a flying block at the front there. And we'll have... Actually, you know what, let's just put... Hmm. This is quite interesting. <laughs> I'm thinking very hard about this. I tend to overthink these sort of things, which is one of the reasons I love these games, because you just go off and off. You just go on and on and on, just creating marvellous creations, and I absolutely love them. And it's been so long since I've played, played one, and Besiege looks like a beautiful one to play, and it really is. Alright, let's try something else. So what if we put a block here, and a block here, and a block... Ooh, let's put a block there and a block there. Just try and keep this bounce. Then we'll go back to flight. And we'll put a flying block there and there. And that should counter the torque. And then we'll put a balloon there and there. And there. Actually, let's get rid of the middle bits. So I don't think we need them. And what happens if we do this? Ah, it just falls to the ground like that. Alright. <laughs> Alright, so I think we do need balloons at the front and back. So let's grab another one of those, let's grab one of those, and one of those, and grab another balloon. Go there, and there. Alright, let's try this. This is our wonderful little airship thing. Oh! Still sinks backwards, and it's still not... Hmm. Do we have anything to ballast it? Well, we have ballast, I suppose. Where's the center of mass, I wonder? Can we see that? Machine info? Block amount, center of mass. Show me the center of mass. Just behind. Alright. You can actually so we can actually change this. So what if we change the mass slightly lower? Will this change? Make it point. Yeah! That's pretty much centered. Alright, let's try this. Still hits the ground. Alright. Let's try increasing the buoyancy. Can we make these more buoyant? Let's try 1 point... 1.5, I guess, is the maximum. Let's do just the front ones, though. Let's see if that works. Nope. And the side ones? Whoa. Okay, that might be a little bit too much. Oh my goodness me! Wow. Wow. Okay. N That's incredible. Look at me, I'm just going into the sky. Bye-bye! I have to leave now, my people need me! I'm just gonna zoom out. Just, as far as I can zoom out. That's crazy. Alright. <laughs> what a wonderful machine! What a wonderful machine. Alright, <clears throat> so we need some way to steer, obviously, and we also need some way to... <sighs> These propellers are annoying just because of the torque stuff. Right, so what if we actually have, like, a wing? What does this wing look like? Like that, alright? Hmm. The wing panel? Does that produce lift? I don't know. <sighs> I feel like the balloons are just the safest way to go, you know? Alright, let's try and take off that, and that, and that, and let's put just a flying block on the front, and a flying block on the back, and we'll make this one a different key. Let's try just you, sure. So that one won't actually spin, and we'll change the side buoyancy down a bit, down to... One. And one. And try this again. Oh, oh that's good. Oh, dude. Uh, what the hell? Oh. Did I just get lasered by something? What the hell just lasered me? Alright, so we need a way to go down as well, it seems. So I'm just going to put this... Uh, I'm going to put one of these little things on the front here, about there. And I'm going to change that one to another key. Let's make this one 
L, and we'll make this one a little bit lower, just so that we can maneuver it a little bit. Okay. Play. Oh, now we are too heavy. Ah, should have thought of that. Ah. Alright, let's just put a little bit more ballast into these. Or at least a little bit more buoyancy. 1.2. And... 1.2. And... Try that. Okay, it is falling down at the front. And that's going to actually drag us down. Alright, so let's put one... Let's put one in the middle, too. This can be our vertical one. And we'll make this one... We'll make this one I. Okay. We'll go play. Oh, this is perfect, actually. Whoop. Whoop. Oh, wow, the thing shoots at you. Whoa. It shoots at you and just sets you on fire. Okay. How is this even possible? Do I need to shoot at it? Um. Hmm. Uh, I'm not sure what I'm supposed to be doing. Alright, let's just try this. So we've got I to go up, and L to go down, and O to go forwards. And... Whoom! You'll never see it coming! Yeah! <laughs> that was beautiful. It's just... No, just fly at him until he explodes. Zone conquered. Oh, man. That was beautiful. Alright, I think I'm going to call that here for today. Um, that has been um, Besieged. This has been a wonderful game, and I think I will play some more of this in the future. But I'll call it there for the moment. And, um, yeah. I've been Axel MC131. This has been Besiege. Thank you all very much for watching. And I'll see you next time.